Hi and welcome to Rosa Ragosa's Creating Magic Flower Workshop and today I'm going to show you what to do with a garage bunch. You're having a dinner party, you've sent your husband down for some flowers because you want your table to look absolutely fabulous, you expected him to go to the florist, he's called at the garage and brought you back a garage bunch. You open it up, a couple of stems of chrysanthemum, a bit of broken chip, a bit of bear grass if you're lucky, some floppy alstro. This is what you've got. I'm going to show you. Oh, look, we've even got eggs dropping off. I'm going to show you now what to do to create a spectacular dinner setting with your husband's garage bunch. So you've come down with your husband, you've got your garage bunch, and you think, Actually, I can create magic with this. I just need some help and I need some props. So you go and find some vases. I know I've got all these matching, but you could use jam jars. You could use any vase, as long as you've got a really tall one for the centerpiece. So, and I've just nipped outside to get a bit of ivy from somebody's wall. My wall. So I'm going to start with my croissants. I'm going to be pretty brutal and chop all the heads off it, like that. I get my big vase and I've cut some cellophane that I'm going to shove in the middle. of flowers and I'm just going to put my hand down and put them in the edges of the cellophane anywhere and then straight down here Twist it round and another piece. Pop it down the other side. Not bothered that it's not going down to the bottom because it will do once we get this water in. So I'm going to fill this up with water now. to the other bits. I'm going to cut these off. Just chop these up. Just chop them up. I've got one rose. are going to come in and say, oh, have you had a florist in today? And then you can do a little sneaky little look at your husband. <sighs> yeah, they, don't, they might take a bit of light in because I've got wet. Thank you. 